Hi, my name is John Von Rensel. I'm here at Full Compass to talk to you all about our newest headphone product, Sadie. Now to understand why Blue made Sadie, you need to understand the biggest problem with the headphones that are on the market right now. If you have an over-the-ear set of headphones and you plug them into your laptop, your phone, or your recording interface, you're going to be sacrificing fidelity to get volume. Those types of devices, whether it's your phone, your laptop, your recording interface, your mixer, the headphone amps inside those devices are not designed to power over-the-ear headphones properly. So you sacrifice fidelity to get the volume out of a headphone amp that's not designed to provide that volume. So what we do is we come up with a headphone that has a built-in headphone amplifier, and that is Sadie. Um, if you see here on this little switch, I could turn the amp on and off so I can run it in passive for my home studio that has a nice headphone amp. But when I'm on the go listening on my laptop or on my phone, I turn the amp on and I'm getting that high fidelity sound without sacrificing adding more power from my device. Now, if you look at Sadie and you haven't seen blue headphones before, you're going to notice a very unique design to these things. These headphones have eight different hinge points. And we designed them that way so that no matter what size or shape your head is, you're going to get a nice comfortable fit and the ear cups are always parallel to each other. So on a typical set of headphones that just has a, a bendable band for the headband, if they're too small, they go like this. If they're too wide, they go like this. What we want to do is make sure that your headphones fit securely because that accounts for a very large portion of the sound quality of the headphone is how well they sit on your head and how close they are to where the drivers are supposed to be over your ear. Another way that we accomplish that is by having ear pads that are shaped like ears. Most headphones have round ear, ear pads. I don't know that many people that have perfectly round earlobes, except for a couple alien friends of mine. Uh, we also use a memory foam for the ear pads, and these drivers inside of here are 50 millimeter drivers. So you get a nice, robust, full sound, especially when they're powered properly with the built-in headphone amp. Now the amplifier runs off of a 12-hour lithium-ion battery that recharges via USB. Now if you accidentally leave the battery plugged in, or, the, or leave the amp on, and the headphones plugged in, what happens is when you take the headphones off, it shuts the headphones down, so you're not going to kill the battery when you're not using them. Now you get about 12 hours of constant use, but if you run out of juice and you're on the go, once again you could just turn the switch to off, and you'll be able to run these things in passive. Now there, if you look at the switch, there's a third setting that says on plus. What that does, it adds a passive bass boost it adds an extra four decibels at 60 hertz. The reason why we added this is because a lot of people like that are audiophiles or just like to listen to stuff that's mastered for vinyl. Uh, when you master a record for vinyl, you have to actually cut out about four decibels at 60 hertz to keep the needle from jumping on the record. So what we do is we add that back with a passive EQ that you could turn on and off as you please. Or if you just want to listen with an extra bit of bass boost, if you're playing video games or want to rip your face off to the new Skrillex album, you could do that. So. So that about covers the features of the new Sadie headphones. If you want to learn more, go to fullcompass.com or contact your Full Compass sales pro.